All right. <clears throat> Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Gothic 2, Night of the Raven, um, Excess Mess Edition. So, we made it into this Temple of Beliar, and there's multiple options. We came in through there. Uh, let me just make sure everything's looking good. There might be some weirdness going on because of the green screen, because uh, we have uh, oscillating natural light interfering with our setup here, so... My apologies if things start getting weird. Anyway, focusing on the gameplay here, we have two, three, four, five, six options. So let's start with the one at the right here. Okay, Shadow Beast Skeleton. Is that it? Yeah. Nothing there. Okay, nothing too scary. And we've got some scrolls and some potions. That's fine. Hmm. Do we have anything else that we can do in here? We have the game massively lagging. We have a key master that appeared that we just smashed. <laughs> okay. Is that it? I cannot go into there. Okay. Okay, so we have a key. I wonder what we use the key for. We'll find out, I guess. Oh, this is a door apparently. Okay, there's two switches. Okay, so that gate is lowered. Awesome. Okay, so let's go back down and see what friendly f folks. Okay, either we didn't open this one or it's on a timer, which I hope it isn't. What about this third? Thing here. Are these potions? What are those? I think I lowered this gate. Okay, is there anything to loot before I go farther? Hmm. Doesn't look like there's anything to loot here. Okay. Okay, well, that was cute. Nothing to be had there. Oh yeah, you guys used to be really tough to deal with, but I am a, a beast, and you cannot stop me. Okay, so there's two switches, three switches. I don't know if there's any certain order that I need to press them in. That sound is looping in a very awkward fashion. Okay, so maybe we pressed it in the wrong order, so let's try left, and then right, and then center. Okay. Okay. 
So it wasn't left, center, right, and it wasn't left, right, center. Let's try right, and then left, and then center. Okay, so it wasn't that either. We're making some nice there. XP this way. <laughs> so nothing there. Just need to heal up. Make sure these guys won't do insane damage next time. Okay, so left, right, center. So let's try center left and right. Got it. Okay, and there's a switch here. Which brings up one pedestal over there. Okay. Okay. Surprise attack. Not surprised. Oh, yeah, unfortunately the game has gone into easy mode. Uh, but don't worry, we'll, we'll spice it up somehow. So this, this gate at the bottom here still didn't open, right? Yeah. Okay, interesting. All right, well, let's go to the uh, left here then. Let's do a save for our progress. A couple of orc elites. That's it, three orkies. There's a shadow warrior there, no guy appeared. So maybe I'm supposed to do something first. Don't know what. There's a rune power sword there. Nice. Probably another sword here. Stormbringer. Cool. Is there a switch I'm supposed to press on one of these? Okay, so I could shoot through this. That's interesting. Do I pull the torches? Doesn't seem like these do anything. Okay. Well, do I interact with this blue light? No. Oh, do I push this switch? Okay, so that opened that. Do I have the key for this? Yes, I do. Okay. Hmm. So I don't know where that is. Uh, we shall. F let's go and backtrack and see if it's back down here. Maybe. No. Is it back in the first room? Stuck in the wall. First room was down here. No. So it must be in the new room that we didn't go into yet. Which is over here, which has a zombie.
which are easy to kill. Nothing, Nothing there to be had there. Nothing there. Nothing to plunder. Okay, and Nothing there. Nothing here. Hmm. Hmm hmm hmm. Okay, before going in there, let's save. Now let's boldly go. And Ah, goblin skeletons. They're cute. I don't know why I'm really bothering loading them. Ma maybe fun. they'll actually drop something unique or something Nothing that I need, there. like a key, but it doesn't Nothing seem like there. it. What? Okay, so I don't know why five of them decided to spawn like that. Maybe I'm against the timer again. Okay, so let's do just like with the other one, center, left, right. Okay. Oh, this is injuring me. What? That was random. It's not center left right. Okay. Is it center right left? <laughs> Yep. <laughs> kind of fell through the graphics there. <laughs> oh my. Okay. So we have two of the four pieces enabled. What? Okay, one skeleton, that's random. This torch is not lit up, what does that mean? Okay, random skeletal mage to floating towards me. Nothing to be had there. Hmm. Do I pull on one of these guys? Nothing to plunder. How do I um nothing to be had there? Hmm. How do I open the other stuff? So we have two out of four. How do we get the other two? Because we're out. We're out of rooms. Unless. Unless these things down here opened, which they didn't. Okay. Is there any l magical switch we have to pull? Is there a magic button somewhere? Not there. Not there. Not there. Not there. At this point I'm out of ideas. We're out of rooms, so obviously we have to do something in, in these rooms. No, no, nothing really works. Unless there's a switch on one of these tombs that I'm not seeing. Okay.
There's no switch. There's nothing. Do I have to shoot something? I just walked through it. Are you... S It was on a, it's an illusion. It's an illusion. Wow. What did I pick up? I picked up two things. Okay, so there's only one switch here. So what can go wrong, right? Okay. There's two switches now. So right and left. Okay. Ugh. Okay, puzzle solved in a very awkward but whatever fashion and our character is invisible. I don't want to save because I, I don't know if it's a glitch or if it's supposed to be an illusion. Then we can just go through this thing. Do not freeze me. We do not freeze. Nothing okay. Nothing there. Well, we're there. out now, so... <clears throat> Nothing to plunder. We can save now. Very interesting. You just walk through it. I was trying to g g try and go and glitch through it, but no, you just walk through it. Oh, those game devs. They funny. Okay, three out of four. And now the last one is down here. Just walk through it. I have to hit a switch. What the heck? How did we get through that one, but we can't get through this one? Okay, we took the sword. Were we not supposed to take the swords? <laughs> So maybe one of the tombs has something. Okay, not that one. Not that one. Not that one. Okay, I don't know what's happening. So blue light means, okay, there's blue lights on the ground. Blue light means it's done. Maybe there's something with the blue lights. We have red lights both at the top here. So let's go back to the top. Okay, there's this torch that isn't on. It's not doing anything. And there's this torch that isn't on. That's not doing anything. And there's this torch, that's not doing anything. This torch, this guy. What the heck is going on, man? Hmm. 
Hmm. You know, with the zombies, we press the three switches. But the middle one just enabled the other two. So maybe we have to press the middle one one more time? Does that make sense? Does any of this make any sense? It's not making any sense. Okay, so again, this torch is not lit up. Nothing we can do about it, apparently. Uh, this is not where the zombies were. Okay. Where were the zombies? Oh, where the invisible switch was. Right. How do I get out of here? What the heck? Okay. I'm... I'm lost. Yeah, somehow we just go through here. YOLO style. So if I just press this, nothing happens. Is there anything else I'm supposed to press here? <laughs> um. Okay, let's, uh, is there anything we press here? Anything on these things? Okay, there's three torches. Column, column. So this one was supposed to have a torch, it doesn't have it. This looks like an inconsistency in design. Did I just shoot the door? Great, I'm stuck. Okay. Uh, maybe something was really obvious and I missed it. I don't know. Okay, well, uh, let's maybe... Do we have to use a spell? Maybe a spell will destroy the door. Let's save. So arrows go right through. Okay. Let's try a spell. Okay, what do we have? A lot of <laughs> ice blocks. Uh, where's a fireball? Oh, we have it equipped. Okay, fireball just flies through. Jumping doesn't seem to do much. Okay, let's try and glitch in. Doesn't seem like it's doable. Gun, I can't glitch into here. That's not good. Um, <sighs> well, well, well. This thing is extra here. Hit these skeletons? <laughs> I don't know, man. What am I supposed to be doing? Can't destroy the barrels. Um. 
Hum, hum, hum. Well, I think it's been almost at least five minutes of me struggling to figure this out. Do I go back in this room? Is there something in this room, maybe? I don't think so. Alright, well, I'm gonna have to call it GG. I'll have to resort to, to a walkthrough or something online, because this is ridiculous. Gothic 2, Temple of Beliar. Alright. Um... Or temple, what's it called? Uh, Isle of Erdorath. Halls of Ildorath. Alright. Found. Let me uh, put it up here so you guys can see. LParchive.org, uh, what I've resorted to. Okay, you kill those guys, you kill this, Keymaster, blah, 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 we did that, we did that, switch, switch, switch. How did you get all four of them? Hold on. To reveal the fourth, different switch, I twisted the large stone and heard the scraping sound in distance. What? Turning both sets of gears once seemed to have unlocked the upper chambers. Two, three. I went up into the top right room, the first area, crypt was filled with undead, but the past the... Portcullis was a switch puzzle. Two Shadow Lords materialized in the corner of the room, but like the Shadow Lord Arkhal, they did not stop me. I tried the switches over and over until I stumbled upon the working combination by pressing left, right, and center switch. I caused the center room to open up. No, 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 no. Hold on. We have to take them back because I'm confused. I don't know how you opened the first one. Four passages lead down from the main room, one to four, with a large entrance, five. At the other end of the room, two locked doors. Three, five, two. What? I first went to check out the room on the bottom left. Someone had reanimated corpse of a shadow beast, made it into the guard chambers, blah, blah, blah. And, and, and the room was connected to another tunnel. Iron gate, I moved to examine it when a seeker appeared to me. Okay, you get a key. It unlocked the two doors. I went inside both to discover that they are upgraded the grates. By pressing the switches, I could choose which grates were up and down, and I could not have all sets down at any one time. What? Is that it? I just have to press these things again? Yeah, I guess I didn't fool around with these. Okay, did that open it? Was that the answer? Really? Okay, I'm dumb. Sorry, everybody. Nope, that didn't open this one. Okay, so let's uh, turn it one more time. Let's see if that did it. I... I'm so confused. Okay, pulling this one again. Okay, that looks like it opened something. Did it open to something that we needed open though?
No, oh, yes, okay, so that was the answer. Good. Okay, nothing has materialized yet. Okay. So that was it. Okay, so I suck at solving pu puzzles. I didn't try repressing the things that uh, originally I had not. Or originally I did. Calm down, chill your bones. Scratching me with your two-handers. Okay, finally progress. <laughs> Let's press the last switch and be on our way here. Okay, the green screen's starting to be a bit fuzzy because the light has changed. Oh, and there's another switch here. Random. Okay, let's save. What is behind the big mysterious door? A couple of seekers, I see. Okay, so this might be booby-trapped here. So we should uh, be careful. We have leveled up. Getting pounded by these guys. A black magician is there, okay. Let's heal up. That looks like Zardus. Okay. So let's just go and loot everything that we have killed so far. It's like another seeker here. And there's a whole bunch of scrolls here. So I don't know where that other seeker is, but. Whew. Look at all these scrolls. And these rooms are full of. Uh, what do you call them? Hierogl hier hieroglyphs? Okay, looks like we stumbled upon a torture chamber of sorts. That is lovely. I'll never get this open without the right key. I need the key. Nothing to plunder. This guy didn't have the key. All right, let's save and let's talk to the black magician. So you slimy worm, you have indeed dared to come before the gate of the master. Are you the one pulling the strings here? I am the guardian of the halls of Irdarath, the mightiest source of Beliar's power on earth. Mm -hmm. The divine strength of the master flows through my hands. Definitely not Zardus. One word from me and you will fall into eternal madness. I see. Guess I'll have to rid myself of another middleman. Who's your master? He is a wanderer between the worlds. His divine wisdom enlightens us. He is the chosen of Beliar, who will free the kingdom from the wretched followers of Inos. Mm -hmm. He brings death to all who doubt his splendor. Mm -hmm. Sounds familiar. What's hidden behind that huge portal over there? <laughs> My lord's chambers remain inaccessible to you. I shall give you no opportunity to open the gate. Okay. 
fine. Just how many more of your kind will I have to kill? We are many. You have no idea how numerous are those who await this time of freedom. Mm -hmm. Cries of lamentation will flood across the land when we go out into the world. To free okay. the world of the barbarians who call themselves the guardians of the fire. Our gathering here in the temple will not last long. Yes. Yes, great comeback, dude. Enough of this shrivel. I shall destroy you. Your sight will fade, and your spirit will vanish into the darkness. Well, that's lovely. That was it. Speed Potion, Black Magician Scroll, Black Magician Key. Alright, let's see. Uh, the key probably opens this chest. Let's heal up before doing anything else. Yep. Okay, Eye of Power. Some gold, rock crystal, and some elixirs. I apparently have no mana. Don't know why that is. And I apparently have over 100 mana. <laughs> oh, Dragon Hunter with over 100 mana. Okay, so we'll read the scroll in just a second. There's a book stand here? What? Cannot read. There's a book stand here. Cannot read. All right. Okay. That looks like a permanent potion, which is good for me. Okay, can't read any of this stuff. Couple of cauldrons, couple more potions. I have another alchemist bench. I don't think I can create anything though. Let's read some more gibberish. Did I get any permanent potions? I got another elixir of strength. And I think that's it. Okay, we have 171 strength. Can we create anything? We have a dragon root, but we have no king sorrow. Six turnips. Okay, so I guess we're done with that. Nothing special in here. Doesn't seem like it. Just a torture chamber with nothing. Okay. Okay, so the only thing left is this door? Kadosh, MM, Kadar. Open. Which we knew the magic incantation for some reason. Cool, cool. I assume we were supposed to read the scroll first. Kadosh, M.M. Kadar, the Eye of Power, illuminate your path. All right. So let's see what we got behind this magical gate. Another dragon. An undead dragon. So I don't know if it, this is the final boss or not. I think it might be. 
So we're going to fight this guy using all our other weapons <laughs> for added YOLOs, you know. So let's equip the Firebow and save. Hi, pretty. So now you've managed to find me. I've waited all too long for your arrival. Come on, stop pretending you planned it that way. Hmm. <laughs> what do you know of my intentions? Have I not sent you the seekers to lure you onto my trail? Have I not left the signs of my existence so clearly that you absolutely could not miss me? And have the dragon eggs not contributed to your armor, which helped you get to me? As much as you twist and turn, you cannot dispute all of that. There is only one thing that was not predetermined. You have destroyed one of my servants. He was chosen to bear the claw. Mm -hmm. As I see, you now bear it. For this outrage, you will die. Oh, I see. Who are you? <laughs> you still have to ask that? Search within yourself, you fool. You're just an you undead dragon. You're nothing. I bear no name. Just as you bear no name. I Ooh, he got us. Burn. Creator. Just as you bear the power of your god in you, my fate is in the destruction of the world. Just as your hand brings certain death, Dragon Hunter. Do you not feel the bond that ties us together? Yes, you know who I am. No. Yeah, you are a dragon. Zardis always said. Zardis is weak and no threat to me. You're a dragon with a glowy bone. Me. So it is written. The time has come to accept your fate. Oh, give me a break. Why are you here? The divinity bestowed upon me will inspire me to drown the world in a river of violence. Only when the last fortress of the righteous has fallen shall I rest. Hmm. On whose behalf are you leading your minions to war against humankind? My master is the Lord of Night. You know him. You can hear his call. My armies will rise from the ground in his name and shroud the world in darkness. All right, buddy. Said, I shall chase you back under the rock from whence you crept, you monster. <laughs> You're not yet ready to defeat me. Only one brief moment, and I shall have reached my goal. Your bones will serve me to let the ill winds of death blow across the world. Okay. So he's regenning. We do not do enough damage with a fireball. <laughs> okay. We do not have ammo anymore. Let's go with the magic bow. Add more damage here. This is a great fight. He's not doing anything anymore. Okay, we'll get him with a magic crossbow for sure. That's a dragon hunter's crossbow. There we go. That was it? I didn't have more? Alright, let's just do this with a dragon bow. Or actually, no, 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 we, we have to defeat him with the Claw of Beliar. That, that's uh, the ultimate BM there. We could also poke him with a good dagger, but let's just go with the Claw. Excuse me. Okay, well he did did us in. <laughs> Fine. I tried to do it with the magic crossbow. I don't have enough bolts apparently. And now we're lagging. Why are we lagging? 
Why are we lagging? Okay, let's load game again. World Dragon Island. Ooh. No, why are we lagging? What the heck? I don't want to lag. Oh my, really? This is how it ends? Oh, okay, we're good now. So now you <laughs> Oh, you have glowy eyes now. Look at you. All right, let's just end this already. Oh, we have the fire bow equipped. My bad. Dragon bow. Retarded dragon. This guy was causing us all the problems? Look at him. He doesn't even know how to fly. All right, he's pretty weak. Let's just go in. Done. There's the finishing blow, and there's a really low res video of us defeating him, wearing paladin armor, or no, dragon hunter armor. It just looked different from the back. Oh, there he is. Hey, Zardis. Okay, so Zardis is harvesting the power and the soul of this guy. And he warped out of there. So what's gonna happen to us? Why did I get teleported all the way back here? It doesn't make any sense. I wasn't done up here. Yeah, give me uh, Undead Dragon Soul Stone. Does he have a stash? I thought we're done, we're apparently not done. Oh! Okay, we have an Undead Orc here. We had there. And what the heck is at the end there? Is this the exit? What is this? Huh. What the heck is this? I don't remember this. Is that... Is that just a rock? Are you serious? You made me walk all the way here for a rock? What? Game. You're trolling me. Oh, and the great dropped no that's not fair come on dude you can't do that to me are you serious okay it goes up nothing, nothing there okay so we killed them there's nothing left to plunder just a few more orcs off to the side whatever i don't care so that's it, that was the big, big baddie, we defeated him, Zardis sucked him up, and now we, uh, we are left to do what? To just run back? Is that it?
Oh, Milton's here. What's up, dude? Do you have experience with dragon eggs? No, not really. I have heard that a clever alchemist once managed to brew a powerful potion from it. Mm -hmm. Please don't ask me for the recipe. I have no idea. We already know the recipe. All right, that's it. The temple is now deprived of its power. How do you always pull it off, hmm? Damned if I know. <laughs> Are we ever going to get any peace? We've certainly deserved it. Come on, my friend. I think the first thing you need now is 40 winks. You should go straight 40 to the winks? captain what? and tell him to weigh anchor. What the heck is 40 winks? I have not heard that expression before. Oh, the other dragon's still dead. Uh, or still here. Yeah. We won't be here much longer. It's like my headaches just blew away. Nice. How did you do that? I have destroyed the enemy. It must yep. have been something very powerful. So what was it exactly? An undead dragon. Hopefully nothing like that will ever happen again. Nope. There isn't as much swamp weed in the world as I'd like to smoke <laughs> right now. All right. Nothing, Nothing there. there. I brought all these guys along, but they were pretty useless. None of them really gave me an option to be like, hey, come with me. I don't think. Even if it was, I wouldn't ask any of them to join me. Hey, you... We can be on our way now. The enemy's dead. Very good. Then tell the captain to weigh anchor. You'll take me to the mainland, won't you? Yes, Corinus will survive without you. Then I can <laughs> finally pay my long anticipated courtesy call on the king. I've waited a long time for this. What do you think? Shouldn't patience finally be rewarded? Patience yeah, and it should. striking arguments. <laughs> yeah. Mm. It won't work without a bit of armed force. It was an honor going into battle with you. May our paths cross again someday after this adventure. Yeah, Ali, that's nice. All right, well, there's the ship. We just go back and... Uh, Sail off, and I guess that is that. We are done here. You stayed with the ship? Sure I did. Just imagine what we'd do if it weren't there anymore. Now what happens? Nothing more. I want to go home. <laughs> home? Where's that? As far as I know, there's no such thing for you. Ooh, that's a <laughs> burn. We hit the next tavern and drink ourselves senseless. <laughs> mm, maybe. Hey, come off it, man. It's over. There's All nothing right. left here for us. Tell the captain to clear the ship. All right. Milton teleported back as well as Lester. Pedro. Have nothing to say to him. Still Lara's the good news. You don't really seem to care about all this. <laughs> uh, you know, I thought you'd make it. What are you going to do now? No idea. I'll guess I'll follow you for now. All right. Let's recharge the eye. Not enough resources. What do you mean, not enough resources? What do you mean, not enough resources? We have a dragon heart, don't we? I have a dead dragon's soul stone. Hey, you! I did it. I know. I can feel it. You have dealt a blow to Beliar, which will keep him busy for some time. Can I retire now, or do you magicians have another skeleton in the closet which needs to be driven from this world? <laughs> always finds a way to enter this world the war will never end only adana stands between the warring gods in order to preserve the balance he should have helped me instead but he did of that you can be certain 
Mm -hmm. Tell the captain that he should weigh anchor as soon as possible. A momentary peace may be deceptive. Oh, Vatras, you're ruining it, everything. Shut up. So I don't know why we couldn't recharge the eye, but uh, okay. Well, this is the end of our adventure. We are a master of everything except creating runes because the game wouldn't allow us. Uh, we are level 67. Um, we had a thousand hit points. A ridiculous amount of dexterity and strength and mana. It was a fun adventure. Excess Mass the Dragon Hunter. The enemy is dead. That's good news. Is that all we needed to do on this island? Yep. And we have another video. I am naked again for some reason. And Zardus the is there. Slew the beast, and it entered into Belyar's realm. Zardus, what exactly happened in the Temple of Irdarath? With the help of Enos, you have defeated the Avatar of Evil, and I have taken its power unto myself. Since I left the Circle of Fire, this alone has been my goal. What was denied to me in the Temple of the Sleeper has now finally come to pass. Belyar has chosen me. So, you obey the God of Darkness now? No, I do not obey Belyar any more than you obey Enos. Not even the gods know what fate has in store for us. And I am only just beginning to grasp what options are open to me. But one thing is certain. We shall meet again. Mmm. Zardus is a naughty naughty boy. Oh, those incredibly small <laughs> credits. So, hopefully I made the video bigger, at least in this last episode. Editing, at least do editing in the last episode. Um, yeah, that was a fun adventure. Next up, Gothic 3, where uh, we chase after Zardus. Or I think there's a couple of different outcomes that we can choose. Can't remember exactly. Was that it? That was a short credits session. Do we get anything else? Oh, the actual credits now. Well, I'm not going to make you sit through it. <laughs> and I'm not going to sit through it. Thank you, Piranha Bytes and Joe Wood. Really fun game. And, uh... Yeah, Gothic 1 and 2. They definitely go very well together. Um, hope you like Hope you like this series. Hope you uh, enjoyed the story aspect of it. Maybe you didn't enjoy the, um, the difficulty route that I took. But I thought it was appropriate um, for an enjoyable Let's Play. One that doesn't require you watching me reload a hundred times every battle as just that's not fun for anyone to watch you know so thank you for watching and i'll see you in the next let's play series that i do excess mess out